Now in this part of the question we've got f of x equals 3x cubed minus 2x minus 6 and we've got to show that a root of this equation, that is where this equation equals 0, that that root alpha is 1.435 to 3 decimal places. So how are we going to do that? Well first of all let's just bring back the graph that shows this root alpha. In the first part we established that the root alpha was between 1.4 and 1.45 and now we've tracked it down to say 1.435 to what we think is correct to three decimal places. But so we can be sure that it's 1.435 to three decimal places what we need to do is take the lower bound of this value and the upper bound of this value and check that there's been a change in sign. So in other words the lower bound for 1.435 would be 1.4345. That would be the lower bound and what we need to do is substitute this value of x into the equation. So we need to do f of this value and see what we get. And if you pass this through your calculator just substituting x's 1.4345 into this equation you find that you get a negative value minus 0 0.01329 and if we substitute the upper bound that's f of 1.4355 okay 1.4355 substitute that in you find that you get 0.003233. So what this is telling us that indeed that there has been a change in sign. You can see that when we take the value 1.4345 the lower bound we get a negative value here say. And when we take the upper bound of 1.435 it goes to positive. So it totally agrees with this graph here. So that tells us that the root lies in this interval because of that change in sign. So therefore what I can say is just to summarize that again therefore since the change in sign change in sign x or alpha, the root, must equal 1.435 to 3 decimal places. And that brings us to the end then of this question.